Inside the Great Hall, a gathering of many political figures, diplomats, lawmakers, and traditional rulers. A moment to reflect a major event which happened exactly 150 years ago. The Battle of Amwafu and the peace treaty signed at Fomena chronicles the event of war and mutual benefits between the Asantis and the UK. By a happy coincidence, the British finally have answered our prayers, albeit in some veiled way, but half a loaf they say is better than none. However, some of the regalia which were taken to the US are here and going to be here until time and circumstances shall be no more. On Monday, February 5, the first batch of the looted treasures arrived in Kumase, readying to be put on display on Thursday at the Menshia Palace. Professor Tom Makaski in 1968 came to Ghana. The Asante history experts extensively studied the Ashanti kingdom and has authored the over 700 page history of Ashanti. He revealed there are a number of treasures stolen and sitting in British museums which need to be pursued. The reenactment of events of 1874 brought some realities of the past to the present. But the most striking one was the looting. Traditional ornaments were stolen from Kumasi to the UK. Professor Tom Makasi believes the Ashantis rallying together will help them to at least bring back these valuables. But what could be a barrier is the British laws. Because even those that are here will have to be returned. I know that British law says they cannot be exported for good, sent home for good, but I think the law should be changed. William Evans Inkum, TV3 News, Kumasi.